In the summer, holiday makers travel to the island of Soto on one train. Hurry! 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 Wong's express trains was busier than ever, which meant all trains had to be scheduled. Express coming through! However, due to the extra trains, they didn't complain endlessly. I get no rest. I get no rest. I get no rest. <laughs> Cheer up, Gordon. At least you're all still working hard. Pah! How can it be worse or better? I've already got more trains than usual scheduled. Yes, and the yards have been in a right mess. Ah, yes, the yards. It must be so hard shunting trucks and be sitting still. Right, Edward? What would you know about shunting? Oh, I know it's not as hard as pulling the express. Later that night, in the sheds, Gordon was still complaining. I am so overworked. Oh great, here we go again. Well, Gordon, we're all busy. The little western has been packed with holiday makers. Well, at least tomorrow will be good. How? A special passenger is going to be on the express tomorrow. Well, I wonder who will get to pull the express tomorrow. If I will pull. I am the most splendid engine on. Oh please, you can't even climb hills. That was one time, Gordon! I'm too busy with the flying kipper. Me and Oliver are busy all day tomorrow, so we wouldn't be able to do it. Maybe I will be able to pull it. <laughs> like that's ever going to happen, Edward. You are too old and weak to pull the express. I still help you over your own hill. Exactly. You are only good for a banking engine. Right. That's enough, Gordon. Go to sleep. Don't worry, Edward. Me and Doc think you'll be able to pull the express. And with that, they went to sleep. The next day, the fat controller came to see his engines. Good morning, engines. Good morning, Good morning sir. sir. Today is going to be an important day about the railroad. A famous author is writing about his experience on the island, and his last stop will be on the express today. Gordon, I have given you the special today. Yes, sir. Edward, I have a busy job for you. I need you to help Jinty with their station pilot today. Yes, sir. Hello, Thomas. How's the branch line? It's doing good. So, Edward, you're working in the yards again today, I presume? Yes, why? Is there a problem with that, Gordon? Oh, no, no, no. It must be so hard shunting and being restful in the yards. I pull the express. Now look here, Gordon. I've put up with your behavior for long enough. 
and it's getting old. And with that old left. Later, while everyone was jumping, the station master came running up to him. Edward, leave those trucks here. We need you right away. Why? What's the matter? Gordon's broken the safety valve, and you're the only engine that we have to pull the express. We need you right away. Ready, Edward? Ready! Edward found it hard to leave the express. I told you he wouldn't be able to do it. Well, old boy, we might have to wait for another engine to come help us. No, I can do it. Edward's fireman put place sand around his wheels to give him a better grip. Ready, old boy? Ready! Slowly, but surely, Edward started to move the train. I've done it, I've done it, wow. Edward started to move the train. Edward moved hard, but pushed on. I did it. Way to go, Edward. That's one of the headlines for old Gordon Nine. Excuse me, could I ask what your name is? My name is Edward. Edward? I am definitely adding you to my new book. For the next couple of days, Edward was put on the I hate shunting. Don't worry, Gordon. As you said, shunting isn't as hard as pulling the express. Oh, the indignity.